Scientists in South Korea have converted cigarette butts into material that coats the electrodes of supercapacitors for extremely large amounts of energy storage. And this vampire plant sweet talks its victims through DNA into lowering their defenses, allowing it to tap into them and drain their fluids. Vsauce, Kevin here, this is Mind Blow. It turns out most people have herpes. In the US, it's estimated that 54% of 14 to 49 year olds have herpes simplex 1, and the worldwide estimate of HSV1, the oral type, and HSV2, the genital type, is somewhere between 65 and 90%. Most people never show signs of it because flare ups can depend on the strain and the strength of the host's immune system, and estimates on the older population having the herpes virus are over 90%. The hyperlapse makes your action footage look like a first-person video game. It smooths out time-lapse first-person video that's normally unwatchably shaky. By using an algorithm that estimates the camera path, removes redundant frames, and then renders a new stitched image blending it all together. And Microsoft is currently working to make this publicly available as an app. The New Horizons NASA probe recently captured video of Pluto and its largest moon, Charon. This is the closest imaging of Pluto ever, 10 times closer to it than Earth is, and they're planning on getting even closer in January. The Bug Juggler is a 70 foot tall robot that juggles cars. Or at least that's the plan. Dan Granite is building a proof of principle arm that will juggle 250 pound cast iron weights that will be controlled by a person wearing a sensor sleeve and glove. The glove provides haptic feedback so that way they can feel the weight of the juggled object. With the ultimate goal of building a giant robot that juggles VW bugs. Because why not? Researchers at MIT recovered sound from recording video of a bag of chips. The visual microphone uses a high-speed camera to pick up the incredibly subtle vibrations on an object's surface, and then those are extracted to partially recover the sound that caused them. For instance, here's audio of a kid singing recovered from video of a foil wrapper near the child at the time. <laughs> Someday you may be able to power your phone with sweat. A wearable device similar to a temporary tattoo features a sensor that measures lactate which is produced when sweating. It strips electrons from the lactate to generate electrical current which is then stored by a bio battery. Currently only a tiny amount of power can be harnessed this way, but they're working on increasing that so we can eventually power a heart rate monitor or a smartphone. This real-time facial tracker with projection mapping can instantaneously change a face. The software references points on the model's face to maintain the projection during movements, altering it from makeup or paint to more advanced reflections and digital designs. And they're looking for ways to implement this in movies and games. Finally, Arc Attack controls an arpeggiator with Xbox Connect, which outputs MIDI to a Tesla coil to make music. I'm gonna leave you with a thousand robot swarm that self-assembles into shapes, and as always, thanks for watching. <laughs>